Hi there, Jason Cook from Cookie Composites. Today in this short video will show you how to install a new cutaway chin cup on your fuel helmet. You're going to need some tools and these will include a 1 8 hex wrench or allen key, 11 mm open ended spanner, a 13 mm open ended spanner and some of our blue thread locker. Before we can install our fuel cutaway chin cup, we've got to actually remove our chin strap. So what we're going to use is our 1 8 hex wrench and our 11 mm open ended spanner to be able to remove those bolts that hold that chin strap in place. So once you've got that chin strap off, let's start the process of installing a new chin cup. So install the ladder strap on the left hand side of the helmet. We're going to need the ladder strap, the silver washer and the large gold nut. First up we install the ladder strap, then we're going to put the silver washer on top of the ladder strap, we're going to apply a bit of the blue thread locker to the screw and then we're going to install the gold nut. Using our 13mm spanner and our 1 8 hex wrench, we can now do up that gold nut until it's very firm. Okay, now to install our black machine button on the right side of the helmet. First off, we're going to put some of the blue thread locker on the screw. Then we're going to start using our fingers to rotate that machine button onto that screw. Now, holding that machine button in our hands, we're going to use a 1 8 hex wrench to tighten up that machine button onto the helmet. This needs to be very firm. The next part is to rotate the handle so that it sits squarely against the edge of the helmet. The final step is to install the Velcro. There are two pieces. One is a piece that's 40 millimeters by 25 millimeters long it's a hook velcro so it's quite rough and it has an adhesive backing. Basically its positioning is beneath a little tag that sits off the edge of the cutaway handle. Peel off the back of the adhesive velcro and place this under that tag on the cutaway handle. The final step is to mate the pile velcro that slips over that tag to the hook velcro that you've installed on the inside of the helmet. So when we're reinstalling the uh, chin cup ladder strap onto the a machine button and installing the cutaway handle, we need to ensure that this handle goes between the fork part of the ladder strap like this. Now you've got your cutaway chin cup installed, you've got to try it on and see how cool you look. Head straight to the bathroom, turn the lights on full, take a dozen selfies of yourself, get it straight up on Facebook. You're looking like a star.